My name is Mahmoud Kamara. I'm the interim director of Amnesty International in Nigeria. I think it was uh, a brilliant uh, opportunity for civil society organizations as well as government institutions to interact and discuss pertinent issues that have to do with um, the respect for human rights and uh, international humanitarian law in Nigeria with, in relation to the conflict that is going on in the northeast of the country. And uh, when I um, came to the hall and uh, had people speaking about the impact of conflict on children, that was the, the ICRC presentation, and the issue of detention in situations of armed conflicts that was uh, presented by um, Tony from the National Human Rights Commission. I think that these are, these are the things that we've been talking about for years, and um, there didn't seem to be some space, there didn't seem to be appetites then among civil society to engage on these issues. And I know that we've been involved as an organization, Amnesty International has been involved in a lot of uh, conversation and, uh, and research and advocacy on these issues. So to have them um, being discussed and being debated, for how, to have people to interrogate these issues and raise pertinent concerns that the government of Nigeria should take into consideration. I think it's a brilliant opportunity, which um, I, I would say kudos to Global Rights for uh, um, organizing. And uh, one thing that has been lacking uh, in the past years is, is that there hasn't been any concerted effort among civil society to actually look at the, the, the core human rights issues affecting people in the Northeast who are being trapped in this cycle of violence and impunity going on in the, in the, in the realm of um, um, the conflict. So to have these um, discussions and to have uh, people being able to interrogate, for instance, the, the, the representative from the Nigerian army was brilliant. So I think this is something that um, global rights should be proud of and they should continue. And as an organization, Amnesty International is happy to collaborate with global rights. Okay, my name is Cynthia. Cynthia Anneli, um, CEO of Total Six Alliance, and also a blogger at um, nigersing.com. Basically, it's been an enlightening um, workshop. As you can see, that today is day two, and um, I think day two was more intense compared to day one because um, a lot of issues affecting us as civilians were really uh, um, dealt on. Pressures talked about children in armed conflict, and um, Amnesty International, Kamara Mahmoud spoke more on. Um, accounting for the missing and the dead in um, armed conflicts and we realize on our own uh, most of these figures most of these data most of these informations are not really out there this workshop have gone a long way to actually give out this the real situation out there and what most of us are not aware of and how now we as from the media aspect now need to first go after the real data the information or meet the people or let's with the communities or the civilians or the parties affected to even know how from their own story how you know the, the whole event or the whole activity went on taking me for an example from the media aspect we actually pick on stories published online summarize it get some um, fact or little fact online not from the people i will put out so this workshop for me has been truly enlightening